And now, Channel 5 News at 10. Well, they're back, and even hotter than ever. We'll show you after this brief break. Just when you thought the Power Rangers craze might be winding down, well, they are back, and with a vengeance. Their new movie opens this Friday at local theaters, and we sent our Bill Smith to talk to some of their fans. Hundreds of Power Rangers swarmed into Hollywood, flashing their mighty Morphin crime-fighting karate techniques. Can you do the Power Ranger moves? Show me one. Do it again. <laughs> Very good. So good, in fact, let's compare these moves to the real Rangers in their new film, Turbo, a Power Rangers movie, a.k.a. Power Rangers, the sequel. Not bad. And judging from this crowd, the Rangers have not lost their magic. Who's under that mask in there? It's you. What's your name? Katrina. Are you one of the real Power Rangers? Oh, I thought you were. Let me see under the mask. Oh, you are real. Who's underneath that mask? Who's in there? It's you. Who are you? Alex. Are you one of the real Power Rangers? Yes. I thought so. <laughs> and who's under this mask? Rebecca. Hi. Are you the real one? No. You look real to me. New for this Power Rangers movie are these turbo-powered cars. But the kids didn't come to see the cars. They came to see the Rangers. Go, go, Power Rangers! And here they come. Jason David Frank, the Red Ranger. Catherine Sutherland, the Pink. Blake Foster, the new Blue Ranger, Johnny Bosch, the Green Ranger, and Nakia Barice, the Yellow. Inside, all doing something some Hollywood stars don't have time to do, signing autographs for kids. But hey, these are Power Rangers. They always do the right thing. And listen, can I hear it one more time? Go, go, Power Rangers! I love it. In Hollywood, Bill Smith, Channel 5 News at 10.